So, forget about that one. We got a better tag here. So, step 722 and smug. Yeah, I remember step um, 722 versus um, it was John Doe. John Doe. Let's see what happens. Two medals already online. Has a decent health lead. Smug just trying to play in the neutral. Oh, not a favorable trade. All right. And, you know, that's part of um, DJ's game. That, that, the, the, the back step mm, for the throw baits. Yep. And already coming to play, he's going to do a lot of damage now. This is slightly nerfed from, from Season 1 because um, his combos don't work the same way anymore. Oh, nice. I'm pretty sure in Season 1, off of that starter, it would have been death. Probably. Yeah. Especially <laughs> you go into like level 2 there. Yeah. Yeah. Monk could get a level 3 in this round too. And you see step 722 already making some adjustments to the, to the back step. Just kind of did sweep immediately after blocking. Assumed the back step was coming. Mm, safe jump, gets the parry for Smug, and gets some decent damage. Wait a minute. All right, gets side switch there, and yep. the reaction. Good damage. This should just be level 3 to see all the game. And it keeps it super simple. Yeah, don't do anything crazy. Just go for immediate, you know, mm -hmm. get the machine gun punch, go to level 3. Don't make it any more complicated than it needs to be. Exactly, exactly. And plus, like, it's just the first game, you know? Like, yeah. An immediate run back. No switching. No pausing. We're going to go right into game number two. Yeah, both of them are character spe specialists. Ooh, oh, that's a bad whiff. But doesn't get a punish off the parry. All right. Nice spacing from Smug. Not trying to overextend. Oh, but as I say that, steals the turn back with the forward dash. I like that Smug is just going for the fireball, baiting the jump in. Now Smug having that pressure. But we do see a grab. One metal on deck. Ooh, and that was a punish counter. Well, it well, actually wasn't a punish counter, but still, you get rid of a, a, a drive bar because you grabbed them yeah. out of it. But Smug still in the lead right now in terms of positioning. Oh, nice punish counter. No follow-up. Maybe try to go for like a drive rush cancel there. I, I think I think you, you go for a flash kick there. Maybe, yeah. it's too far. But I mean, probably didn't have charge. Oh, nice flash kick. But put Smug and Burnout. But it doesn't matter, you just go for the sweep. He's been so on point with those those slides for Antiris at that range. Definitely baiting him. The, the spacing on Wake throws fireballs, that's perfect. Nice reaction on the drive impact from Steps on 722. Let's see the punish. Oh, oh no! Level 4. This might be bad. Tries to bait out a flash kick there. Smug smartly walks away instead of using it. Smug just playing the fireball game. Try to bait seven, uh, Step to just jump in if you can. OD version. Nice rush in. Well, yeah, almost to the point where Smug can kill in one hit. If you get a nice counter hit, oh, 100%. All right, now it's, yeah, I think he's a hit away if he gets a good hit. Oh, yeah, we saw that a low forward. I yeah, he's, he's fishing for it. Yep. But now, and Step knows that, and then Smug can just go for like the safer option, go for the grab. To be with it, it's not bad. To be fair, Step can do a lot of damage too, because, uh, um, the the metals um power up the level three as well. Uh oh, 
Oh, oh just yeah. whiffs, and that should do it for Smug. Keep it simple. I'm going to be moving on. That might have killed if it landed. <laughs> I get four medals up. Maybe five. It, it does 5,000. It does 5,000? If, if you have 